Hello friends, it's Running Kimono and it is Tuesday the 23rd. We're getting close to Turkey Day and it is so flippin' bright in my backyard with the snow. It makes this weird thing where all the um, items on my table, they just have this weird sheen of light. So we're gonna do a little slideshow and talk. Hi to my mom if she's watching. I hope she's having a terrific day and I'm sure where she lives up in Northern Ontario, she's probably, Northern Ontario, Canada, probably snowy and a very similar picture to this today. Okay guys, first deal we're gonna talk about is the Walgreens curbside with the Viva. And yes, I went for Viva because if you have a lot of pets, this is a really great uh, paper towel to clean up some oopsies. So this is a curbside pickup, meaning I ordered it through my phone to get a little percentage off. And I made a video about this earlier today and I know a lot of you had a lot of success with it. It's either with the Viva paper towel or the Cottonelles uh, for $3.99. Okay, so adding three to the basket, and if you wanna mix and match the Cottonelle and Viva, yes, you can do that. Then we have a little promotion code that we can use, and this is for online only. You cannot use the promotion code in store. It's a free pickup because I'm getting to the store myself to pick it up, it's not being delivered to my home, and then I have my tax right there. Now this is the code that I used to get that extra percentage off. It's FAST10. If it doesn't work for you the first time, log out, log back in. I had to do it twice to get it to work. Take 25 is not working. As you can see, I got that $1.20 off, which is really fantastic. And then I used $10 of Walgreens cash and I paid $1.42, went to the store, photographed it to the Fetch Rewards app and laughed all the way to the bank and back. And just to show you, um, Mine is spend 20, get back a $1.50. Um, for whatever reason, guys, I didn't grab a screenshot when I photographed it the second time, but I did get back my $1.50, so that was awesome. And then Shopkick is giving back a little extra something as well, so you might want to check that app. I think this is just a solid deal to use $10 of Walgreens cash to get some inexpensive Viva. It shakes out to $0.47 cents, um, after everything is said and done with my tax here in Michigan, but uh, very happy with this little dealio. Okay, so now we're gonna cruise over to the Dollar General. In this deal, you really have to pay attention. This is part of a four day sale, so um, you have to get it on Wednesday the 24th or it is a dead one. So we're gonna be grabbing this five pack of the Bic lighters for five for $4.95 and that little one for $3 on top, that little pink one. Here are the UPCs if you want to uh, look for the exact one. I will let you know that smaller single lighter with the one, even if you um, scan it into the app, it's not gonna show as anything. So you have to take a leap of faith here at checkout. Um, and I know that if you're not about that, then just do not do this deal, um, but it's not gonna show up properly in the app. Okay, so at checkout, uh, see where it says $4.95 and that's a five pack of lighters. That's the specific one that you have to grab and see how it says four day sale. That's why I'm telling you to get this by the 24th because the sale ends on the 24th, which is a Wednesday. And then this single one was right next to it. So near the batteries and all that stuff, this might be harder to find though. And this is the digital coupon that you need loaded, which is the BOGO uh, free. Um, it is to grab one of those packs to get that little lighter thing for free. And then the other promotion is part of the four day sale. So that's how the math is so uh, goofy. So just to show you the quick breakdown for this and mathematically it doesn't make any sense, but this is how it's working. Grabbing one of those packs for $4.95 and then one single lighter for $3, that's $7.95. Subtracting the BOGO promotion for the week, or the four day sale, and then the BOGO digital, you're paying $1.95. Now that's six lighters for a buck 95, it actually shakes it out to 32 cents per lighter. So what a, a awesome little deal. Okay, so now we're heading to Walmart and uh, you have to do this deal by Saturday the 27th because the coupons are uh, kind of expiring on that date. So it's definitely use it or lose it to get some of this finished stuff really cheap. One of them's a rinse and the other ones are those little packs to put in your dishwasher. And for the longest time, I could not find them at my store, but then they just magically appeared this morning. So I grabbed a couple. Um, so the first little uh, deal that we're gonna talk about is with those packs. So as you can see, you have to grab the Quantum. They're 377 and then we have a $2 coupon. This is from the smart source of um, October the 31st. Over on, over on Ibotta, there's a $1.50 back and you can do this of a limit of five. So grabbing one of these for $3.77, subtracting that $2 coupon from the smart source of October the 31st, you're paying $1.77 and getting back a buck 50 from Ibotta, making this 27 cents. Not too shabby. Okay, so the finish jet dry uh, rinse aid is $3.64. My mom swears by this stuff. We have a dollar coupon also from the October 31st smart source. Over on Ibotta, there's a dollar back when you buy one of these rinse aids. 
And this guy is exactly like the eight ounce one. So it is the larger one. So um, I think you buy one of these and it will last you a really long time because you use it quite sparingly or unless you do dishes like five times a day, like Mrs. Empty Nester. Just kidding. Over on your Fetch Rewards account, I had $2 back. And this is a weird one because it keeps saying like, it's going to expire, but then it always, it's still there. But you can only do this one once uh, just to note that, but still that's $2 back on a $3 item. So that is not the worst thing. Pairing it with a coupon and I bought it a little better. So grabbing one of those liquids, it's three sixty four. dollars Subtracting that dollar coupon, you're going to pay $2.64, a dollar back from Ibotta, $2 back from the Fetch Rewards app. Um, so it makes it free plus a 36 cent money maker. Um, so I'm just delighted with this. I really hope the Fetch Rewards uh, rebate resets a couple times. Also, when I was in Walmart, I found some premier protein. This is a new flavor called cake batter. There must be something wrong with this packaging because this stuff just came out, I think, in September. It was like the rage of... Um, Amazon, my friend who's like a really big Amazon lady, she's like, oh my gosh, look at this. If you're doing the keto diet or um, if you've gone through a gastric bypass, you know this is the cat's pajamas of protein drinks, very low in sugar and very heavy in the protein. Here is the UPC if you want to look for it in your store, look for it on BrickSeek's website, whatever you want to do. Um, but uh, I was really surprised to see it and I bought every single one that they had. They only had four left, but I got all of them because I was like, this is a really good deal. And usually they're about $8 uh, for a pack of four. So to get $3 for four of uh, drinks, that is a really good price point. Okay, so one stop I did do today was over at Bath and Body Works. If you remember, I was making like videos on the weekend about uh, they had a soap sale where these soaps were $2.95. Now, I bought five Christmas themed ones for hubby's bathroom and he smelt it and he's like, I, I can't, no, it's too fragrant. And he doesn't like anything with a heavy scent because it does give him a headache. So I went there today with my receipt and just did a, um, you know, exchange, no problems, no issues and uh, just an absolute joy to shop over there. As it is their Black Friday week, I think that box of uh, goodies, you buy $40 of merch and then you get a, you can pay $40 for this Christmas box that has a value of like a hundred bucks. Um, it starts tomorrow, which is the 24th. So I'm really looking forward to getting my hands on one of those. So something to be on the lookout. I got this mailer a couple days back um, and this is what I can use now for candle day. So the pricing of the candles for candle day is unknown. It's rumored that it's going to be on the third and fourth, which is a Friday and Saturday where candles, the three wicks that are 25 will be either nine or $10, but pairing it with a 10 off of 40, I'm basically going to get like one candle for free if I buy four of them, which is like super cool plus a little free gift. So I'm looking forward to that. Uh, so you might want to be on the lookout for these. They come in the mail. Um, and even if you have a friend that uh, gets one of these and they're not going to be going out for candle day, ask very, very nicely. Okay, guys, that's it for this video. We'll catch you in the next one. Bye.